Talking next, Byron native Brody Lamb shining for the sixth ranked Minnesota men's hockey team. And for his performance this week, Lamb earned a Big Ten Second Star of the Week honors. A sophomore at Minnesota, Brody totaled four points with two goals and two assists in the Gophers' win and tie against then eighth ranked Michigan. Currently, Lamb leads the Gophers in points with 10. He has six goals and four assists through 10 games. He's already surpassed his point total from last year. Lamb in Minnesota hosts number 17 Notre Dame for a two game series this weekend. Coming back to town here on the ice, it is hockey season. Century John Marshall girls hockey team hosting Apple Valley at the rec center. First period, Apple Valley, a shot here from the blue line. Goalie Isabella Scranton flashes the glove. That's a nice save. Keeping this one scoreless. Scranton had a few saves like that in this one, but this Apple Valley team kept attacking. Michaela Moran, solo dolo, puts that in. That's money. Panthers down 1 0. Off the faceoff here, Anna Hansen sends in a shot. That saved. Rebound, Layla Kokowski. Ice slam. Two goal lead for Apple Valley. So in the period, 3 0 game now. Brinley Gretz going bar down for a goal. Central Jam trails big here. It's left check. No score reported in this one. To the local grind we go. Stuartville announced today that quarterback Aiden Helder is one of 10 finalists for the 2023 Mr. Football Award. Helder's been dynamite this year as the signal caller for a 12-0 Tigers team looking to make some noise this week at U.S. Bank Stadium. Just look at the numbers. 71 completion percentage, 2,083 yards, 38 touchdowns against just two, two interceptions. Again, the senior is one of 10 finalists. The award winner will be announced on December 10th. Let's go to college basketball.